Good morning, Wolves, and welcome to Dummy M, your source for news around the meadow. I'm Casey. And I'm Nazaya. Today is Thursday, May 4th, 2017. Ms. Brinson is here for a few announcements. Good morning, Wolves. I have some first grade students' uh, names to announce today for our character award for the month of May, the award of respect. So congratulations to these two students whose teachers nominated them as the first grade representatives for the character trait of respect. The first student is in Miss Isadori's room. Congratulations, Chris Francisco Roman. Stand up, Chris. Chris is always respectful to both his peers and adults. He sets a great example for everyone around him by always using great manners and being polite. He is an awesome role model and truly treats others as he would want to be treated. Congratulations, Chris. The second student to earn the character award for respect is in Miss Tucker's room. Congratulations to Nevea Brown. Stand up, Nevea. Ms. Tucker says that Nevea is always showing respect to her peers, her teachers, and other staff members. She uses her manners and her kind words to help her classmates. However, it does not stop there. Her words and manners go hand in hand with her actions as well. She is a role model for her classroom. Congratulations, Nevea and Chris. And I have some other students' names to announce. Before our break, we set an I Ready Challenge for the school, and the students in each grade level who completed the most I Ready lessons over their break would be um, Mr. Hook's Field Day Helpers, which is coming up tomorrow, unless there's a rain delay, which we'll find out later. But the following students completed the most I Ready lessons over their break and will um, serve in this role as Mr. Hook's marshals. In kindergarten, in Ms. Nimser's room with 25 I Ready lessons, congratulations to Anna Yelton. In first grade, in Ms. Isadori's room, congratulations to Timothy Green, who completed 19 lessons. In second grade, in Ms. Deal's classroom, with 23 lessons, Nicole gonzalez Lore. In third grade, in Ms. Hughes's classroom, with 35 iReady lessons complete, Malachi McFerrin. And in fourth grade, in Ms. Weston's classroom, with 12 lessons complete over the break, Henley Lyon. And in fifth grade, in Miss Robinson's room, the student with the most lessons complete, nine, who will be an all-day field day helper with Mr. Hooks, is Kylie Taylor. Congratulations to all these students. There is a storm coming in. I don't know if you've been watching the weather. I guess they'll update you on that soon, right? And so we will let the school know by the end of the day what our plans are for field day tomorrow. If we can go ahead and have field day or if we'll need to postpone it to a drier day. All right, thanks and have a great day. Thanks, Ms. Brinson. Hey, Nazai, what's on the menu for lunch today? Today I'll be having baked spaghetti with Texas toast, grilled chicken, BLT, Potato wedges, spinach salad, fresh grapes, chilled pears, milk, bar for today burger. Now let's check in with now let's check in with Sada for today's weather report. Good morning, Wolf. Today will be partly sunny with pleasant temps. In the high 70s with a 50% chance of rain this evening. Enjoy your day, now back to the news desk.
Thanks, Katie. And is there, are there any birthdays today? A happy birthday goes out to Brayden in kindergarten, Meisel in first, Missy L in first, and Desire, Alex, and Amari in fourth. President Ice Cream and Cake, oh my. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs> I, I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Well, that's it for today's news. I'm Naziah. And I'm Casey. Wolfgang says there's no place like the metal. Go Wolves.